Welcome to the island. Ladies and gentlemen, please stand for the playing of the national anthem. gentlemen thank you for tuning in to the island blend miss universe jamaica northwest 2020 pageant i am rush rebel your host for this evening this is a vantage point production services event welcome to the show we'll be guiding your experience of these contestants journey to the crown we are proud to hold this event at the Ibero Star Hotel and Resorts here in the beautiful Montego Bay. We have seen several beautiful ladies competing for the ultimate prize of being crowned the Miss Island Blend Universe Jamaica 2020. These finalists have been training for several weeks during the COVID pandemic, traveling from across Jamaica. They have been through eliminations and a comprehensive personal development program. Now, they are here to show you why they should be crowned queen. Appearing for the first time, it is our pleasure to introduce the contestants in swimwear as we witness their journey to the crown. Now, this segment is brought to you in part by 876 Beachwear.
name is Shante Jarrett, Miss Island Blend Health Hub. Miss Beauty Stop. My name is Kimberly Hudson, Miss Millennial Media Management. The amount of beauty and confidence that radiates on this stage is tremendous. I'm very sorry for our judges. And speaking of judges, we have a distinguished panel of adjudicators whose job is to determine who will wear the crown. Of course, no pageant is complete without these special people who have the toughest job. Our judges for tonight, ladies and gentlemen, will be none other than... Janet Silvera, Carl Williams, Mark McDermott, hear that? Silence. Ever since I moved out of mommy house, I can just kick back, relax, have a drink. And it's all thanks to Gateway with a 7.4% interest rate financing up to 95% of the house. And if you're doing a home equity loan, they finance up to 100%. Now what's better than that? What's really better than that? We are weapon. Gateway Cooperative Credit Union. 
For more information on our mortgage plan, visit our website at www.gatewayja.com. Opening the way to your financial success. Get your shipments to Jamaica within 24 hours from your USA shipping address. Free lifetime membership. No credit card, no problem. Ocean Freight Services. Get your packages picked up in Miami, Fort Lauderdale to Jamaica. How? SSMC Express International. Visit any one of our offices located in Montego Bay, Kingston, Portmore, Mandeville, Savannah Lamar, Ochoas, Portland, and Maypen. Call us at 876-754-4332 or visit our website at express-intl.com. Service delivery at the speed of light. And now, let's welcome on stage internet sensation, Dottie Berry. What's up, Rush? Hey, I'm here. What's up? <laughs> All right, so ladies and gentlemen, viewers, welcome back to the Grand Coronation Show produced by Vantage Point Productions. Now, if you've just joined us, you are watching the Island Blend Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest 2020. You missed an awesome opening number and a fantastic swimwear segment. Indeed. And we want to remind you that this show is brought to you by our title sponsors, Island Blend Health Hub. We have seen the seven finalists in swimwear. And now, to make our evening even more exciting, let's welcome back our contestants in evening wear. And joining our finalists on stage is contemporary classical singer Rory Frankson. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome Rory Frankson and our top seven finalists dressed in evening wear.
and I'm feeling good. Fish in the sea, you know how I feel. River running free, you know how I feel. Blossom on the trees, you know how I feel. It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new life for me. And I feel it good. Dragonfly out in the sun, you know what I mean, don't you know? Butterflies all having fun, you know what I mean. Sleep in peace when day is done, that's what I mean. And this old world is a new world and a bold world for me. When you shine, you know what I mean. Scent of the pine, you know how I feel. Freedom is a mine, and I know what I mean. It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new life. It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new life. It's a new dawn, it's a new day, it's a new life, it's a new life for me. And I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. I feel so good. Just wow, what an emotional experience in Barry. Rory Frankson's beautiful voice was complimented by the confidence and poise of the beautiful ladies. Just wow. And you know, Barry, I don't think anyone but Rory can be Rory Frankson. That's definitely true, but I'd like to believe that um, I could be Rory if I wanted to. Is that so? Yes, I actually taught him exactly Let's hear everything. it. Let's hear it then. I don't, so that sound like you don't believe me. Let's hear it. Okay, let me just do a little thing. Introduce me, please. Ladies and gentlemen, the classical singer, Dotty Berry. <clears throat> Tell me when will you be mine? That's it. That's that, it. That's all I give you. That actually sounds good. Are you lying or are you telling the truth? The truth. <laughs> all right, thank you. Wow, <laughs> beautiful. Hmm. Okay, so I have to go ahead and introduce these sponsors.
Cash Rebel and we're here with the 2019 Miss Universe Jamaica and Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest reigning queen, the beautiful Iana Tickle Garcia. So Iana, tell us, what has been the most inspiring moment of your reign? Well, I have to tell you, it's been overall quite an inspiring reign, especially with everything that's been going on yes. and my own platform. Mm -hmm. But if I had to choose one moment, as simple as it is, yes. I think I would choose my visit to the Hope Valley Experimental School. Ooh. I went there with a friend of mine, mm -hmm. Joel Numdarkam. He organized it. Right. And we were just there speaking to the grade six prefects and sub prefects nice. and just hearing them talk about what they thought of us after we, mm. you know, introduced ourselves Thanks. and they were like awed. And they were even more amazed that we were so young and we were so accomplished. And just hearing them talk mm -hmm. about how we inspired them wow. and how everything that they were going to the, everything that they wanted to achieve mm -hmm. it really made me feel one to know that you know these little kids they look up to us and you know sometimes we feel that we're not doing much and we're not really making an impact but hearing that feedback wow. it really does a lot for me ah, thank you that's amazing thank you for that all right Iana, i want for you to tell us that one piece of advice that you would give to the incoming queen on which to have an impactful reign you know Ever since I won Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest and then Miss Universe Jamaica, I always thought like way ahead into the future. Mm -hmm. What am I going to tell the next queen? Like every single day I learn a new lesson yeah. and I, I'm just like, I need to compile all of these because I want her to have that. Wow. Um, but one thing, the most important thing I believe, especially to have an impact, right. is to take initiative. Mm. You are now an influencer, you are now um, I think the face, right. but not only the face, you are also the the person that all of these young girls, and not even just young girls, but mm -hmm. a lot of people are going to be looking up to. Right. You're not waiting to be told what to do. You're going to, ah, you're going to see that. Like that. Exactly. You're going to see it and you're going to go after it. No matter what mm -hmm. um, challenge or no matter what difficulty you might face, you're going right. to go after it and you're not going to wait on someone to tell mm -hmm. you what to do and how to fix it. You're going to do it yourself. Definitely. So I think that that is probably the most important piece to be, to, you know, make an impact. Amazing, wonderful, thank you. Having reigned for a full year, which is coincidentally ending in 2020, what are your plans for the future? Well, I have actually recently started university. I took a gap year so that I could really focus my energies on Miss Universe Jamaica, doing my best and mm -hmm. also just trying to figure out what I'm going to do with my life. I know people would like to think that, you know, I have it all figured out mm -hmm. and everything, but really and truly, like I needed this year to, you know, explore and to kind of come out of my comfort zone. So now I've started university and I'm doing cultural and creative industries. Ooh because I think that's more where I'm leaning towards. I'm not exactly sure right. what I want to do in the future as yet, but mm -hmm. I do know that I want to continue. After having a taste of this mm. impactful year, I yes. know that I want to continue doing that. So um, over this year, I have developed my platform, which is really and truly the environment, right. specifically recycling. And I know that this is not something that I want to end with mm -hmm. my reign. I want it to continue and to build upon it. So. Really and truly, even though COVID has come <laughs> and kind of put a pause and it's been a large barrier, mm -hmm. I want to find ways to surpass that yeah. really, and to continue doing what I have always been preaching about, which is, you know, saving our environment as, you know, ludicrous as it might sound. Um, and inspiring others to do the same. Uh, thank you so much. That's absolutely amazing. And we do wish you the very best on your journey. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, there you have it, the beautiful, the Miss Universe Jamaica and the Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest 2019 reigning queen, Iana Tickle Garcia.
Get your shipments to Jamaica within 24 hours from your USA shipping address. Free lifetime membership. No credit card, no problem. Ocean Freight Services. Get your packages picked up in Miami, Fort Lauderdale to Jamaica. How? SSMC Express International. Visit any one of our offices located in Montego Bay, Kingston, Portmore, Mandeville, Southern Lamar, Ochoas, Portland, and Maypen. Call us at 876-754-4332 or visit our website at express-intl.com. Service delivery at the speed of life. You hear that? Silence. Ever since I moved out of mommy house, I can just kick back, relax, have a drink. And it's all thanks to Gateway with a 7.4% interest rate financing up to 95% of the house. And if you're doing a home equity loan, they finance up to 100%. Now what's better than that? What's really better than that? We are weapon. Gateway Cooperative Credit Union. For more information on our mortgage plan, visit our website at www.gatewayja.com. Opening the way to your financial success. It is absolutely an art from God and that's what I believe. And with that, I decide that I am beautiful. And it's all about self-worth and self-love. And I really hope that as Miss Universe contestants, that you will have just that, the love for yourself. Right here at Professional Eye Care, we practice that. And we be sure to take care of the ones that you love. Please call us at 1-876-393-EYES. Visit any of our six locations and we'll be sure to take care of you. All the best to all the contestants and God bless you. Burger King is back with some new king deals. Two delicious combo flavor that's real. Bacon, cheese, burger, fries, Coca-Cola. Or six-piece nuggets with fries and a soda. Each king deal is only four fifty. Limited time, so you gotta move quickly. When it comes to great value, BK got your back. King deal is the deal of all deals as a fact. BK King Deal. Order through HelloFoodJA.com app or 619-M-E-A-L. Taste rules your way at Burger King, the best tasting burger under the sun. Conditions apply. Hello. My name is Ramonia Wright. I am 27 years old. I have a bachelor's degree in biochemistry. And with that, I am now a medical representative. On days when I'm not busy with work, I enjoy swimming, running, and socializing with friends and family. The driving force that led me to compete in the Miss Universe pageant is the opportunity to share the confidence that I've gained from people who support and believe in me. Having a support system is a gift, and I really want to share it across the universe. I am also eager to use this platform to raise awareness about domestic violence. I plan to highlight how it impacts women, children, and men so that as a nation, we can address it and eliminate it from our society to build a happier, safer Jamaica. Thank you. You say my name on Haren. My name is Kimberly Hudson, a passionate social work major hailing from the beautiful parish of St. Anne. I am 21 years old. I enjoy reading, exploring nature, making people smile, and a variety of sports. My favorite is netball, which allows me to take full advantage of my height. Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest will allow me to be a role model to disenchanted youngsters. I want to show that with hard work and persistence, you can achieve anything you set your mind to. And I stand as a living testimony. I will use this platform to target the children's homes in Jamaica. This project is close to my heart and I believe we all have a story to tell. My efforts will assist these youngsters by giving their stories a voice. Shape our youth, shape our nation. Thank you. Hello, my name is Neshe Martin, a 22-year-old receptionist and an aspiring research scientist 
who enjoys listening to our sweet, sweet reggae music and going on excursions around our beautiful island. It is my pleasure to be a part of this rich Miss Universe tradition of confidently beautiful women dedicated to success, service, and the advancement of our world through social causes. I believe in the value and power of good leadership and that many people are held back because of mental health concerns. I'm dedicated to the idea that strong minds make strong leaders and I intend to use leadership and counseling tools and training to reshape our local communities and save the lives of many. Thank you. Hello, my name is Donnie McDonald a 26-year-old receptionist who lives by the mantra, it is better to have explored life and make mistakes than to play it safe and not explore it at all. In my spare time, I like to practice makeup artistry, read inspirational books, and travel to tourist attractions. I enter this pageant to boost and develop my self-confidence building my self-esteem. I will use this platform to raise awareness to the issues of mental health by paying attention to these concerns. We can help people afraid to seek counseling gain greater confidence. Thank you. Hi, my name is Lenisha Davis, a 23-year-old dental hygienist who has hires to bring awareness to the importance of oral health. I love to swim, sing, and socialize with my friends and families. The essence of Miss Universe is to be confidently beautiful, and in my line of work, I promote confidence through the beauty of smile. Behind our smiles, we possess the wisdom and ability to be our best selves. I want to be a beacon for woman empowerment, not only in Jamaica, but across the world. This pageant is a great opportunity to gain experience, build my self-confidence, and use the platform to bring awareness to the importance of oral health, ultimately touching the lives of many. Thank you. Hello, my name is Shante Jarrett. I'm a 19-year-old college student pursuing a degree in criminal justice to fulfill my desire of becoming a crime scene investigator. I enjoy the sophistication of the performing and visual arts, but also the roughness of sports such as football. This duality is a necessary mindset in tackling the curveballs life sometimes throws at us. By being a part of the Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest pageant, I look forward to my self-development as a woman, but also to use this platform to spread awareness to those who may be affected by mental health illnesses. I want to help young people to strive for their goals no matter the threat of defeat. Because in this football game of life, there may be fouls and penalties, but the game continues. Play on. Thank you. Hi, I'm Natasha Pritchard, a lover of both the visual and performing arts and an aspiring entrepreneur. I'm 19 years old and I entered the Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest pageant in hopes of becoming a young lady truly worthy of exemplifying what it means to be a queen. I hope to inspire young girls like myself to never give up on their dreams as I have not. Because when we pursue our heart's truest desire, truly anything is possible. I want to help young girls who are victims of circumstance and make them victors by providing them with opportunities to help them grow. Thank you. All right, so welcome back to the Island Blend Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest pageant. The evening just keeps getting better and better as we journey to the crown. I tell you, Barry, now we have seen our top seven finalists in evening wear and feasted our eyes on their swimwears. We're getting much closer to crowning our queen for 2020. So let me just tell you this. Our seven finalists have survived the cost casting call, preliminary eliminations, and mm. two months of personal development. They've also completed a round of pre-judging. Ah, and the scores from the pre-judging, ladies and gentlemen, round 
will be added to the scores from their appearances on stage today. The top five contestants will be one step closer to the crown. So the top five finalists in the Island Blend Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest 2020 have been selected. Ooh. And in no particular order, the top five finalists are... I'm so nervous. Whew. Ladies and gentlemen, yes. the first contestant mm -hmm. to make the top five finalist is... Wow. Mm -hmm. Contestant number two, Natasha Pritchard. And joining her on stage is contestant number six, Kimberly Hudson. Ah, yes, yes, I can feel the nerves, but you are all winners, ladies. Joining her, the third spot, ladies and gentlemen, in our top five finalist goes to contestant number five, Lenisha Davis. Oh my gosh, Rush. Only two spaces remain in the Only top five. Two. Oh my gosh, the fourth spot goes to none other than contestant number one, Ramonia Wright. Ah, now there is only one, only one spot remaining in the one, top five of the digger. Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest 2020. Yes. Now, last but by no means least, ladies and gentlemen, the final spot in our top five goes to contestant number seven, Shante Jarrett. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. These beautiful ladies are the top five finalists in the Island Blend Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest. 2020 pageant. Now that the top five have um, have been selected, they will face the panel of judges in the first round of questioning. Yes, and I want to remind you or advise you rather that each finalist will now select a number from the jar, which will correspond to one of our judges. Now the appropriate judge will be invited to ask the contestant a question. Let's move right into that. Okay, so at this point in time, once I've called your name, I'm going to ask you to step forward. You're going to pick one of the judges' name, after which you'll be asked a question from that judge. Okay? So first up is contestant number two, Natasha Pritchard. Okay, so I'm going to ask you to select a judge. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you have selected Carl Williams. Hi, Natasha. Congrats on making it to the top five. Thank you. Your question reads, you have the opportunity to address Jamaicans on a national broadcast regarding COVID-19. What do you tell them? Thank you. I believe it's important to be mindful of the fact that the protocols, guidelines, and regulations that our government has put in place is in our best interest. Wearing a mask in public places, sanitizing, all of that is also we can be better safe than sorry. And until then, stay safe, Jamaica. Thank you. Thank you very much, contestant number two, Natasha Pritchard. So up next, we have contestant number six, Kimberly Hudson. Kimberly? Let me see which judge you selected. Carl Williams yet again. <laughs> congrats, congrats again. <laughs> um, Thank you. What quality in your 
itself are you most proud of? And how will you apply this quality during your tenure as Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest? I am most proud of the talent that I have received to motivate people. Day in, day out, I am the motivator of my peers, my fellow contestants sometimes, and on my team. If I were to be crowned Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest, I would motivate children to follow their dreams. If I can do it, anyone can. Don't let anyone tell you that you are not good enough. Just believe in yourself and whatever you dream, you shall achieve if you put the, the necessary work in it. I thank you. Okay, that is it for contestant number six, Kimberly Hudson. Okay, so relax, you know, don't be nervous. I'm here, I'm here to support, okay? All right, so we have contestant number five, Lanisha Davis. Are you ready? Go ahead. Let me see. Please don't tell me to say you pick Carl again. Hold on. <laughs> Let me see this. Okay, Mark McDermott. Oh <laughs> good evening, Lanisha. How are you? I am good. How are you? Fantastic. Looking wonderful, and congratulations. Thank you very much. <laughs> All right, my question for you this evening is, Name something during the course of your life that you've failed at, and what have you learned from it? Thank you very much. You're welcome. <laughs> what I have failed at in my life is to always look at the bright side. I've always been a type of person to see the glass as half full, half empty. But over a period of time, you start to learn that things happen in life, and you can't really manage the circumstances so the best thing that you can do is to start seeing the glass as half full and start to make strides to making yourself better and improving yourself and that is what i have done thank you okay thank you okay thank you very much contestant number five all right i see you smiling i can't see the smile through the mask oh my gosh bob's a green i love the outfit here <laughs> okay so you go ahead and pick mm -hmm. let me see now Oh, okay, nice. So this, the judge that you have selected is Janet Silvera. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Good evening. Good evening. What, what industry or sector in Jamaica should the government target for a quick recovery of the economy in the face of COVID-19 and why? Thank you. The, sec the sector that the government should target is, of course, the pharmaceutical sector. As a biochemist, I understand that we need more finances to help to, to provide enough sanitizers and anything that could help during this time. We also need to understand that we need to find a vaccine for this virus. And if Jamaica, as small as we are, can help to, to find a, a, a correction for COVID-19, that will definitely be um, really good for us. Thank you. Okay, thank you very much, contestant number one, Ramonia. So now we're down to the final contestant, the final lady in the top five. And it seems as if this was a planting because we have the two political colors beside each other. Oh my gosh. Contestant number seven, Shanti Jarrett. You feeling good? Don't make Lisa Anna see the dress here now. <laughs> All right. Yes, one. And so your judge is Mark McDermott. Oh, dear. <laughs> Shante, congratulations. Thank you. You've reached top five. It's not easy. Um, right. So congratulations to all the ladies as well. Uh, think and listen carefully. I have a very difficult question for you. Tell us why we should crown you Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest. My name is Shante Jarrett. I possess confidence, intelligence, but also comfort and a soothing smile that can bring joy to anybody. And I think that that is what you're looking for in a Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest, which I possess and I will bring to the table every time. Thank you. Thank you. 
There you have it, our top five finalists in the Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest 2020 pageant. That's right, Rush. Our judges will now compute the scores of each contestant for pre-judging, swimwear, evening wear, and the questioning we just witnessed. From these scores, we will whittle our field down to the top three finalists. Listen, Barry, the suspense is palpable. In just a few moments, we will know the three ladies who could possibly go all the way as queen. But first up, we'd like to thank our title sponsors, Island Blend Health Hub and a host of other sponsors. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. When we return, we will find out who the top three ladies will be. This is the Island Blend Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest 2020 pageant. I'm going to ask you to just like leave your comments, turn up your fire emojis, let me know which contestant you want to see in the top, the top three. Okay, sit back, relax, and enjoy. My name is Karen Young, and I'm the brand representative for Island Blend Health Hub, manufacturers and distributors of the Natural Vibes Roots, a traditional organic roots drain. Natural Vibes Roots is a unique blend of the highest quality ingredients and roots found right here in Jamaica. Roots are a traditional part of the Jamaican culture. Yes, it's normally consumed by different ethnic groups, but what we have done with the Natural Vibes Roots is that we have blended it in such a way that even the non-traditional root drinkers, even women, can enjoy. This year, we are proud to be the title sponsors of the Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest 2020 pageant. Island Blend Health Hub is a lifestyle brand and we seek to partner and support brands and initiatives that foster healthy lifestyle choices and the Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest 2020 pageant is one such brand. We are proud to be a part of this journey with the ladies as they transition through the various stages of the competition as they are molded to become young leaders and women who will positively impact our nation. To all the participants, well done. You should be very proud of yourselves. And while there can only be one queen, know that you are all queens in your own right and you all wear crowns. To the reigning queen, we want to say congratulations. We hope that your reign will be a prosperous and impactful one. Ladies, continue to strive for excellence. And we at Iron and Blend Health Hub Wish you all the best in your endeavors. So I'm to you about my brother. You see that this one I drink, I eat me with some firm and strong look on it. I dem thing I have to drink you. All right, cool enough. Yeah, what money am I dealing with? Yeah, the team, 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 Natural, natural vibes. vibes, it works, it works. Natural vibes. 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 vibes, what good, what good, what good, Do you want more customers? If the answer is yes, you're looking for Millennial Media Management. We are your one-stop digital marketing agency, specializing in web design and development, graphic design, social media, and content marketing as well as digital strategies 
including WhatsApp and email. We help small businesses and brands drive sales, stimulate growth, and develop customer relationships through bespoke digital strategies. For more information, you can call 876-595-4712 or find us on social media at Mr. Millennial Man. King is back with some new king deals, two delicious combo flavor that's real. Bacon, cheeseburger, fries, Coca-Cola, or six-piece nuggets with fries and a soda. Each king deal is only four fifty. limited time, so you gotta move quickly. When it comes to great value, BK got your back. King deal is the deal of all deals, that's a fact. BK King Deal. Order through HelloFoodJA.com app or 619-MEAL. Taste rules your way at Burger King, the best tasting burger under the sun. Conditions apply. Welcome back. Yes, yes, yes. Now for the sectional prizes. Firstly, Miss Congeniality. Miss Congeniality is a sectional prize completely decided by the contestants. They have selected the most gracious, the kindest, the easiest to connect to, to connect with sisters during this period. Winning Miss Congeniality is contestant number two, Natasha Pritchard. Of course, she received the trophy courtesy of Vantage Point Production Services. Congratulations. Now we're going to head to Miss Photogenic. Now, during the personal development sessions, contestants were coached in posing, photo shoots, and life behind the camera. We've done several photo shoots and will present each lady with a complete portfolio of images. This sectional prize is bestowed to the young lady who has taken the best photographs during these photo shoot sessions and appearances. You ready for the winner, Rush? I am. Viewers, are you ready for the winner? The winner of Miss Photogenic is contestant number seven, Shante Jarrett. And she will receive a trophy, trophy courtesy of Island Blend Health Hub. Miss Altruism, ladies and gentlemen, is her next sectional prize. Miss Altruism goes to the young lady who has been most consistent with giving back to a project. You like them something there, right, yeah, Barry? I like that. Beautiful man. Something they've been passionate about. Each contestant has an altruistic mission to make the world a better place. The winner, ladies and gentlemen, is contestant number seven, Shante Jarrett. Shante, of course, receives a trophy courtesy of Island Blend Health Hub. Okay, viewers watching, viewers watching, there are more sectional prizes to be given away. Now I'm going to head to the People's Choice Award. A public voting platform was set up online. The public and finalists were invited to have their fan base cast votes for them. The young lady with the most votes walks away with this award, and that person is contestant number three, Tinashe Martin. And she will receive a trophy courtesy of Island Blend Health Hub. Yes, beautiful. I am absolutely loving it, loving it. Now, ladies and gentlemen, our next sectional prize social media award now during the training period the contestants were encouraged to use social media to start the process of building their personal brands now each contestant posted workout videos some of which i watched i did i loved them by the way they posted training videos as well as special moments that were you know special on their journey yeah. receiving the greatest number of mentions Captured by our algorithm, ladies and gentlemen, is 
Contestant number five, Lenisha Davis. Our next sectional prize is for best in swimwear. Now this goes to the young lady with the best overall fitness and poise. Rosh, you have fitness? I do. You have poise? I do. All right. The judges evaluated how she carried herself during the swimsuit, swimsuit portion of the pre-judging exercise. Physical measurements are not considered in judging. The judges assessed how the contestants displayed their best performance and most confidence while wearing swimwear. And the winner is mm. contestant number one, Ramonia Wright. <laughs> and she'll receive a trophy courtesy of Island Blend Health Hub. Ladies and gentlemen, our next sectional prize is Best in Evening Gown. We're now able to announce the winner of Best in Evening Wear. Now this sectional prize goes to the contestant who carries the gown with the most poise, elegance and grace. The gown themselves are not being judged, but how well the young lady carries the dress. The winner is... Contestant number five, Lenisha Davis. Okay, so we're going to be keeping the momentum going with the best personality interview. Now, this went to the contestant who did the best at the pre-judging interview segment. Are you ready for this winner rush? Okay, so the best personality interview goes to contestant number five, Lenisha Davis. Ah, uh, yes. And of course, Barry, you know we want to talk a little bit about what the Queen's prizes include, right? Yes. So the winner will get an automatic placement in the Miss Universe Jamaica pageant. Ladies and gentlemen, we are here with the brand ambassador of our title sponsor, Island Blend Health Hub. Her name is Karen Young, and we're going to have a chat with her right now. Karen, how are you doing today? I'm great, Rush. How are you? Awesome. I'm fine, thank you. Karen, I want for you to tell us, you know, with this global pandemic affecting all areas of economy, what is the force for Island Blend Health Hub, you know, partnering with the Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest? Entity. Well, Rush, to be honest, um, COVID has come for more than just the um, economics of our business. It has really come for the spirit of our people. Yeah. It has been a time where persons have become fearful, they have become doubtful, they have been wondering what's next. You know, there's yeah. a lot of uncertainty. And the Miss Universe um, Jamaica Northwest competition definitely brings the opposite of that. Yeah. It has really brought a lot of joy, a lot of empowerment to the lives of the young ladies mm. who are involved, but not only to them, right. but also to their families and friends who are watching yes. and cheering them on. And even the community, because some of these girls are from communities that know that they're involved in the pageant and are also excited about what's happening. Mm -hmm. So we felt that it was so important for us to partner with something that was going to breathe positivity back into yes. our people. And so therefore, it was a no-brainer at the time when we were presented with the opportunity despite everything to just jump on board right. so that we can help this initiative beautiful i love that thank you for doing that thank you for being a part of that yes, thank you Karen. of course island blend is a lifestyle group of companies offering various products geared towards helping us live a healthier life 
and we definitely re recognize the synergy between the Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest organization and your company. So what kind of parallel to that decision? Well, to be honest, the Word of God says what? Can two walk if they don't agree? And as businesses, we're always seeking to partner with persons that share our same vision, right? Mm -hmm. And so therefore, it was a no-brainer. If it is that the Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest shares our vision and they're impacting lives and we want to be a part of that because that's what we're all about, impacting lives. As you said, we're a lifestyle brand and so therefore we care about people. It's not yeah. just about the business and the finances, but the persons or consumers, the community or country matters to us just as much and so therefore it was a no-brainer mm -hmm. for us to be a part of this um, competition. Ah, amazing. Thank you for that. Yeah. And of course, that leads me to my other question. What made you, Karen Young, you know, decide to be a brand ambassador, the brand ambassador for Island Blend Health Hub? Well, I guess it ties into what I said initially in terms of what the objective of the company is. Mm -hmm. Because I am a person who loves everything Jamaica. Even my makeup that I use is Jamaican made. Ooh. And so therefore, Island Blend Health Hub and the natural vibes, mm -hmm. root drink that we promote and manufacture is a 100% Jamaican um, brand. And so therefore, we really care about our people, really care about the, 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 the using our natural ingredients, mm. ingredients that are found here in Jamaica, brand Jamaica. And so therefore, as somebody who's passionate about brand Jamaica, I love empowering individuals. I love seeing people being their, their best, mm -hmm. their best self, even as I'm striving to be my best self. And that this brand represents that. Even through our natural vibes, roots drink, we seek to give persons the ability to really live their best life by giving right. themselves proper nutrition and so forth. And so mm -hmm. I felt like the objectives were similar and I could see myself thriving and growing with this company. Not, not just in this company, but with this company. And so for me, it just made sense that I could partner with the Island Blends Health Hub. And what better way to close off this segment, ladies and gentlemen, there you have it, Karen Young, the brand ambassador of our title sponsor, Island Blend Health Hub. Welcome back. And now, ladies and gentlemen, our top three finalists will be announced. In no particular order, ladies and gentlemen, our first finalist in our top three Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest 2020 pageant is contestant number five, Lanisha Davis. The next contestant, ladies and gentlemen, making it to the top three is contestant number one, Ramonia Wright. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, our final pick for the top three goes to contestant number six, Kimberly Hudson. Yes, yes, our wonderful top three. Have a look, ladies and gentlemen, have a look. Yes, the cameras are rolling, the lights are flashing. Feast your eyes, ladies and gentlemen, on the fabulous, the fantastic top three finalists. Now, let me advise you that the scores from the previous rounds have now been wiped totally clean. During this segment, each contestant will be asked the same question. Therefore, the other two will be ex escorted off stage and out of the auditory auditorium. Wow, the surprise. I'm, I'm going to ask contestant number five, Lenisha Davis, to step forward while Miss Ramonia Wright and Kimberly Hudson leave the stage. Lanisha, congratulations again for making it thus far. Thank you. You're welcome. Are you ready for your question? The question goes, 
The Miss Universe tagline is confidently beautiful. In your own words, I want for you to describe the meaning of this tagline. Thank you. You're welcome. I believe confidence is one's own quality that... My apologies. <laughs> I believe confidence is the ability that one has that they can portray without coming off as arrogant. And once you're beautiful on the inside, it will show on the outside. It does not matter which quality, you just have to be proud of yourself without harming anyone else. And that is to be beautifully confident. Thank you. Amazing, thank you so much, thank you so much. We now invite, ladies and gentlemen, contestant number one, Ramonia Wright, to take the stage. Good evening, Ramonia, and congratulations. Good evening, thank you. Your question goes, the Miss Universe tagline is confidently beautiful. In your words, your own words, Ramonia, I want for you to describe the meaning of this tagline. Thank you. To be confidently beautiful is to be very com comfortable with yourself. It doesn't matter your background or your complexion or what you do. You must feel comfortable and feel good within yourself. And you should bring your best foot forward. So in, in that way, you can achieve whatever you, do, you're, you are, you can achieve whatever you feel like, to, whatever you believe that you can do, you will do. Thank you. Ah. Beautiful, beautiful. Thank you so much, Ramonia Wright. Now we invite our final finalist of our top three, Miss Kimberly Hudson to the stage. Good evening, Kimberly. Congratulations. Are you ready for your question? Yes, I am. Awesome. Here goes. The Miss Universe tagline is confidently beautiful. In your own words, describe the meaning of this tagline. Thank you. I think confidently beautiful. To me, it means to be strong in whatever you do. Beauty is not only about looks. It is about personality, elegance, poise, the way you treat other people, and I think all of that is engraved in Confidently Beautiful, the Miss Universe tagline. Thank you. Ah, beautiful. Thank you so much. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen, or answers from our top three finalists. Now, all the contestants, of course, and the final decision of the top three is in the capable hands of our adjudicators. On the 28th of June, 2019, I had the extraordinary privilege of being crowned Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest 2019. This was a happy starting point to my journey towards the Miss Universe Jamaica crown, but it was also a pivotal moment in my life because it showed me and everyone watching that I was able to put in the work and my work was paying off. It has been a wonderful year filled with many blessings and many challenges. As a life experience, it hasn't been easy and it hasn't been without its trials, but was it worth it? All the effort put in, all the hours spent training, all the sacrifices made, and the answer is absolutely. Never have I felt as fulfilled as I did on the day that all of my work was paid off. First here at Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest, and then finally on the Miss Universe Jamaica stage. 
This experience didn't just open doors for me, it constructed a whole new building. I am forever grateful to every single person who was able to make that happen and who was able to push me even when I felt at my lowest. I want to say thank you to Michelle Parks who helped me from the very beginning, who saw what I didn't see and what many persons didn't see. To Carl and Mark who have helped me so much and help me to realize who I am and who I can be as Miss Universe Jamaica and just as Iana. To my parents who have been supportive even when they didn't think that this is the route that I would take. And to all my friends and to my Miss Universe Jamaica contestants who became like sisters to me and never let me fall and never let my crown slip even when I didn't really know what I was doing. I want to say a special thank you to Shane and Trilissa, who were my confidants throughout this entire process. Never once did they let me slip. This experience would have not been the same without you, and I'm so grateful for everything that you have done for me. Everything that Carl and Mark know, and everything that they do. At this time, we would like to invite the current Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest 2019 and Miss Universe Jamaica 2019, Iana Tickle Garcia, to make her final parade down the runway. Now, Iana started on this very stage and went all the way to Atlanta, Georgia, to represent her country. All the way, I tell you. And I had the opportunity to chat with her earlier on today, and she's so warm, so beautiful, so poised. As she prepares to perform her final duties as queen, we want to say thank you to Iana. One of these three contestants will be walking away with her crown today, today, Iana. today, today, today. The question is, are you ready? I don't think I'm ready and I'm nervous. In a you rush. have to be ready. I feel very nervous. I don't know who it is going to be. If you feel like you spot your winner, please leave a comment. Type her name right now. Right now. Ladies, Ladies and, and gentlemen, gentlemen, the, the winner, winner of Miss Universe Jamaica, Jamaica Northwest, Northwest 2020, 2020 is... Contestant number five, Lenisha Davis. Congratulations, contestant Congrats. number five, Lenisha. This is our new queen. Take a look at her, ladies and gentlemen. If you're watching, please leave an emoji, a fire emoji. Congratulate the new queen, Miss Universe Jamaica 2020. Yes, yes. I'll have to correct myself. I think I'm speaking ahead of time. <laughs> yes, right. Northwest. <laughs> Yes, an absolutely beautiful moment. For 2019 Miss Universe Jamaica and Miss Universe Jamaica Northwest Queen, Iana Tickle Garcia. Crowning or Queen. Absolutely amazing. She takes her walk, ladies and gentlemen. Our 2020 queen, contestant number five, Venetia Davis. She takes her walk, ladies and gentlemen. Make some noise. Send some fire emojis. <laughs> All hail the Queen.